gotten a show for y'all. Got a damn good show. Sean Penn. Man, I, that dude, I, I loved his movies. Great, he great actor, man. I liked him in Fast Times at Richmond High. I liked him in Casualties of War. Uh, he, played, uh, he played a great white supremacist, homophobic soldier in Casualties of War. You should got an award for that. From New York City. He, he nailed the accent. UVC? UVC? That's VC right there. <laughs> I mean, just the way that damn gay, sl- that gay slur that, F- that starts with F, the way it rolled off your damn tongue, it was like perfect. Yeah, you should have, you should have won an award for that. Yeah, but uh, he, he, you VC, I ain't a VC. Yeah, Diaz, he ain't a VC. <laughs> See, Keith here, Keith ain't no VC. But you, I don't know about you. You might be VC. Yeah, if y'all didn't see the movie, y'all don't know what the hell's going on. They know what the hell I'm talking about. Who the hell hasn't seen that movie? Casualties of War. Majority of our fans are white. (laughs) They probably seen Casualties of War at least 10 times. Matter of fact, when I get home now, I'm going to go ahead and watch it for the hundredth time. Yeah, but anyway, um, Sean Penn won a bunch of Oscars. I I don't know. I think a bunch. More than one. He won Oscars for his acting performance. And he went to go meet his buddy Zelensky in Ukraine again. Yeah, he stands with Ukraine. I stand with Ukraine, too. You do? Yeah. Yeah. I don't I'm not, I don't stand with Russia. You stand with Russia? You stand with Russia? Oh, I see what you're doing. What am I doing? I see what you're doing. For the sake of this video, I stand with Ukraine. <laughs> <laughs> we all stand with Ukraine. Yeah. Hey, Kevin. Not financially. Hey, Kevin, Kevin, Kevin. Anyway. He's being facetious. Of course we stand with Ukraine. Just not financially. That's all. They they gotta find out fight their own. Hey body. man, I'm over this. Okay, okay. Take hey, it easy. so Sean Fucking Penn. Fucking BC. So Sean Penn went to uh to go see the Vladimir Zelensky. His first name's Vladimir? Vladimir, yeah. That sounds Russian. Yeah. Vladimir Zelensky is Russian, ain't it? Well, you take you look at the country of Africa, Nigeria, you got Sudan. Mm-hmm. It's two different countries, but it's in Africa. How you think they look? <laughs> Same damn names. <laughs> so I mean that's why Russia's so pissed off because he they feel whatever. So Sean Penn went to uh, Ukraine to see his boy Liz- Zelensky, right? Check this out. This is for you. No, Sean. Yes. <laughs> no, please. It that was, is yours. No, I I feel terrible outside. But if I know this is here with you, then I'll then I'll feel better and stronger to, for the fight. Yeah, forever. I feel like that. Yeah. yeah. And in, in in my fantasy life, I'm in your shoes, being as courageous as you. I, in my peace life, it was a dream. In my Thank peace you. life. When peace. you when you win, bring it back to Malibu. Great. Yes. Great. Okay. Because I'll feel okay. much better knowing there's a piece of me here. We have to win. <laughs> we have to win quick. But quick. Yeah. He said, we need to win quick. How do you win wars quick nowadays, especially when it's up against Russia? What, 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 what are you supposed to do? Take that damn trophy and start beating up uh, Russian soldiers? You hey. should have pawned it. Got about $50, $100, right? <laughs> Give it to Zelensky. Yeah. Maybe you could get him a couple of smoke grenades. Because uh, they need money from the White House. The White House put this out there. They want to send uh, Ukraine, I think it was 38 Thirty-eight billion, yeah. That'll be what over. Yeah, you got seventy that. billion, ain't it? Yeah, that'd been over. That'll be over seventy billion dollars, yeah, right? Uh, go ahead and pull it up. If the U.S. gives them this thirty-seven billion, that's like a hundred billion dollars. Uh, we've we've a uh, hundred billion dollars. Yeah. Uh, but anyway, you know, I mean, with a hundred billion dollars, you know what the um, United States could have did with a hundred billion. You know how much a billion is, right? One billion. It's a thousand million. Yeah, there you go. Just to put things in perspective, a thousand, one billion, one billion, a thousand, thousand million. We didn't give him a hundred of those. Yeah. If you, we give him another thirty-eight billion, if you check that money, you can like actually be able to count all the votes the same night of the election. Hell, you could fortify all our schools, put an armed guard in there, twenty-four-seven, metal detectors. Like 10, 50 hey. times over. Yeah. I mean, I'm glad the cameras are there so you know this is sincere, you know? Yeah, that's important. 
I mean, how yeah. can you prove this ever happened, man? If if the cameras ain't there, the ca- that's the most important thing, man. You got to make sure the cameras are there. What's the chances of this happening if there's no cameras? What are you saying? Y'all know what I'm saying. You trying if to say? If there was no Instagram, no social media, no cameras, uh-huh. would he have gave, given him this uh, trophy? You think that trophy's real gold is just brass? That shit is copper. They just paint that shit with gold paint. Shit ain't worth nothing. How much is Oscar, man? Yeah, Siri. Siri, no. Man, you asking that stupid. Hey, Siri, how much is Oscar? <sighs> we do it again. Hey, Siri, how much is an Oscar? Hey, man, stop sniffing in my damn How mouth. much money is an Oscar? All these damn ads, man. Except. How much an Oscar? How much money an Oscar award worth and how much does it weigh? Who gives Despite a shit? Despite the elaborate ceremony, the Academy Awards financial value to winners does not come as a as prize money. But it's career-long earnings boost and lavish gift pay- bags. Nobody cares. Hey, Kevin. What are we doing? Hold up. What are we doing? But despite there being no payment for the winning nominees, there are numerous other ways in which attendees will benefit from the night. I ain't reading all that shit. Yeah. You, know, you know how much that shit worth? Academy Awards, while the Oscar statue is only worth a dollar. Yeah. That shit's a dollar. <laughs> <laughs> hey, um, how? okay, he has to give it back once they win. How is Ukraine going to beat Russia when they shoot missiles into uh, Poland? Yeah, man. They said that was Russia's fault, though. Because they're fighting them? Ukraine got excited. Something, somebody made a mistake in the accident and they shot one of their friends. I remember this talking about sending some, I remember this talking about Ukraine. We need to send them some planes and then we need to teach them how to fly them and then it's just fine. That's something you need, like, years of training. Yeah. You're just going to train them for, like, what, a couple months and they're going to get the hang of it? Yeah, everybody knows this. Everybody's watched Top Gun. <laughs> You just can't put a person in a damn plane and expect them to be what's, any good. What's that movie, Independence Day, when Will Smith went in that plane, that alien plane, and just automatically knew how to fly the bitch? <laughs> That's, it's just that simple, right? <laughs> you don't, people don't make any sense. Yeah. I mean, it's the thought that counts. It's symbolic. I guess it's, you know, it's a, it's a, it's a piece. It's, it's motivation. It's an incentive for him to win the war. You know that's uh, it's motivation. Yeah, you know r- while this war is going on in Ukraine, they're banning some news agencies from uh, reporting the news there because they're not reporting it how they want to want it reported. Really, got any proof? Sound like a conspiracy theory? No, there's some articles up. They're banning mm-hmm. news agencies for what? For not reporting the news correctly. No, they just uh, they- Sean Penn. What we're trying to say is, man, you're out of touch. That trophy is. I mean, the shit's worth a dollar in the United States. What is Zelensky supposed well, to do with he, it? He, well, I guess he's giving it to Zelensky to galvanize him. Look, if you don't want to keep my trophy, I want it with you. Win the war and then give it back. That dude's out of touch, man. I know the media out here made it seem like Zelensky was on the front lines with his show with his soldiers like he George Washington. Why does he have time for Sean Penn to come in and bring a damn Oscar to his uh That dude's hiding in a bunker. I mean, it's, I'm just tired of all this shit. Yeah. Damn, good show. It's a horrible show. For more great shows, click one of these two videos right here. Dude gave away his trophy. Hey, we got some comedy shows coming. We're going to be in, where we going? Macon, Georgia. We're going to Dothan, Alabama. Houston, Co- coming Texas. Coming to Houston, Texas. Arlington, Texas. Why Corpus he, Christi, Texas. I don't get it, man. Why he give up his, uh, that was stupid. He's just trying to stay relevant. You think so? No shit. He can't be that damn stupid. You stay relevant by, you know, going to um, rehearsing shit. And you go to auditions. That ain't going to give him a role. What are you talking about? Talking about Sean, Mr. Penn, Mr. B.C. You ain't no B.C. I ain't no B.C. Diz here? He ain't no B.C. Keith? Keith don't look like no B.C. Fuck off me. But you? Sean Penn? I don't know about you. You look like a VC. 
Cut this fucking video off. <laughs>